Hey, what's going on? This is Yahya Abdul-Mateen II. I play Anthony McCoy in the upcoming movie, Candyman. Hi, I'm Nia DaCosta, director of Candyman, and we're here with BuzzFeed today to take a quiz to find out if we'd survive a horror movie. I'm pretty sure I will be able to do that. I'm not trying to die. Let's find out. Generally speaking, do you consider yourself an optimist? It's yes, no, and I'm a healthy balance, but I would say I'm a pretty optimistic person. Usually I would go with absolutely yes, but I'm gonna go with I'm a healthy balance these days. Are you comfortable being home alone at night? Yes, no, eh, how late is it? I think right now I'm a little bit too comfortable being home alone at night, so definitely yes. You know, if you're up too late, it's like 2 or 3 a.m. and you're like, this is when dark things happen. Sometimes if it gets that late, I'm a little uncomfortable. Maybe that's really my answer, how late is it? Because if it's too late, then it feels like, it's like the witching hour, you know? <laughs> I don't want to be awake for that. Okay, next question. You're home alone when suddenly you hear a loud crash upstairs. Would you go up to investigate it? Yes. No, uh, I'm out of there. Now, this is tricky because am I supposed to just leave or just stay there? You know what, I'm starting to realize I won't survive this film because I probably would go, <laughs> go investigate. Make sure nothing dropped and broke. I'm gonna go investigate it. If I'm being honest, 100%, I'm gonna go see what the big crash was. I will take a stick or take a bat or a something, but I'm gonna go investigate, armed. Do you believe ghosts exist? Absolutely, I believe ghosts. Yes, no, I'm not sure. My answer, without a doubt, yes, ghosts exist. I'm gonna go ahead and say no, not because um, I'm very adamant about this, but because I just can't live with that reality. It's too much energy. It's too much, so absolutely not. Have you ever used a Ouija board? Yes, no, I haven't yet, but I would. Absolutely, of course, I've used a Ouija board. Um, last time, that was in high school, in the building called Masters Hall at my school, and the board moved really weird and everyone went running and screaming, and that was the last time I played around with that nonsense. I actually have. I don't remember much about it, but I know that I have, and I would do it again, so I'm <laughs> gonna say yes. Okay, your phone rings in the middle of the night, it's an unfamiliar number, and you're not expecting a call. Do you answer it? Yes, no, who the hell is calling me? I don't even answer numbers I don't know during the day, so I absolutely am not <laughs> answering that call. Also, I'm not looking at my phone at night, so absolutely not. That's a full on no. Who the hell is calling me, but I'm still not gonna answer it, so I'm not, I don't wanna leave no doubt I'm not answering an unfamiliar phone number. No time of the day, let alone late at night. Have you ever said Candyman into the mirror? Yes, no, I'm not trying to die. I have, but I haven't said it five times. So a little bit of a trick question. So this has a little bit of a yes, but the answer is I'm not trying to die because I haven't said it five times. So your boy got some sense. Yeah, I'm not trying to die. So that's gonna be a no for me, dog. Okay, do you tend to trip a lot over absolutely nothing when you run? Yes, no, and wow, this is specific. Yes, this is very specific, but I already know where this is going. The answer is no. If I get caught in a scary movie, that's not the way that I'm going down. Um, put up a fight and I'm gonna run as fast as I can. This is specific, but this is very important because as a human, I'm very clumsy when I'm just walking around trying to do things, but when I run, I'm very focused. So no, I do not trip when I run. You and your closest friends go away to a cabin in the middle of nowhere <laughs> for the weekend. In the basement, you find a strange book. Do you read from it? Yes, no. Why did I go into the basement alone? Again, it's gonna be a no from me. I'm gonna leave that book where it is. I brought my own reading materials. I have my Kindle, <laughs> so I'm good. Why did I go into the basement alone? That's my answer. Why did I go into the basement in the first place? And definitely, why did I go into the basement alone? Next question. Do you lose your car keys a lot, especially in important moments? Yes, no, I mean, I guess. I absolutely lose my car keys and my house keys and any other keys that you have, I will lose them. I will always find them, but Yes, I will always lose them. No, never. I don't lose my keys because I put them in the same place every day. I always know where they are. And finally, do you personally believe that you are prepared to survive a zombie apocalypse? Yes, no. I'm as prepped as I'll ever be. I think that's my answer. <laughs> and that doesn't mean yes, and it doesn't mean no, but it means that I'm not going to be any more prepared than I am, even if I'm not prepared. It's, that's, that's, you're going to get what you're going to get. So I'm as prepared as I'll ever be. I've thought about this, and I'm absolutely prepared for a zombie apocalypse. I know which friends to go find and help. I know which ones would get me killed. <laughs> I know where to go. Absolutely, I would survive a zombie apocalypse. Let's see how I did. I think I'm gonna make it out this movie. Yes, I would live. So I got, you'd live. Ah, oh, yes. I got it, I made it. It wasn't easy, but I did it. I am the final girl or boy.
I'm a young man. <laughs> You're cool, calm, and collected, and would keep a level head in this type of horrifying situation. You definitely live and thrive. I like that thriving part. I like that a lot. But I'm glad to know this affirms what I already knew about myself, that I would absolutely survive a horror movie. <laughs> that sounds like me. I'd be very irritating in a horror situation because everything would be about logic, and I'd probably be the last to get myself in some terrible situation. So I made it. Thank you, BuzzFeed. Make sure to check out Candyman in theaters. Check it out.